the HyperX Alloy Origin keyboard. Now you've probably seen this keyboard being used by quite a lot of players such as Whitecat, Emrek, Murami, and some other notable people as well. And the reason I've decided to review this keyboard is because I've actually saw Spaza 17's video of it and I was quite intrigued. If so many top players use it and Spaz himself says it's good, then it must be a great keyboard. Well, after playing with this keyboard for quite a few days, I gotta say, I can definitely see the appeal of this keyboard among Osu players. Now if you haven't watched Spaz's review of this keyboard, he mentions that the switches, which are the HyperX Reds in this case, are what mostly makes a difference. And I can agree to that point. The HyperX Red switches feel lighter than the Atari MX Reds on my Ducky 1-2 Mini. And not only do they feel lighter, but they also sound louder. Of course, this wouldn't be quite a keyboard review video if I didn't include a sound test. Now aside from the feel and the sound of the HyperX Red switches, the keyboard's build quality feels pretty solid. After all, it's made out of aluminum which is probably why it feels relatively heavy, but that's also a good thing. In terms of the keycaps they come with, they are more or less just alright. I do wish that they had a texture on top of the keycap just like the Ducky 1 2 Mini, although it doesn't affect me that much while playing Osu, so it's fine. Now it's the gamer feature the RGB. This keyboard features full RGB and a software that you can download to go and customize it in any way you want. Personally, I just prefer to set it to a solid color to match the rest of my setup, and I also set it to 50% brightness because this thing can get really bright. I turn it down a bit so it doesn't distract me during gameplay. Speaking of gameplay, playing Ozu on this keyboard was an enjoyable experience. Just clicking circles overall felt nice, whether it's jumps, streams, or bursts. It felt nicer playing compared to my Ducky 1 2 Mini with the Cherry MX Reds. And remember that this is all preference. A portion of you may not like these switches, and just because top players use them does not necessarily mean that they're good. When I first started playing on these, I did not exactly have the first best impression as I was probably not used to the keyboard, but after a day or two it started to feel a lot better, and I think it just took a while for me to get used to. Now I wouldn't say it's a perfect keyboard, but it's definitely a good one. I can pretty much type just fine on this, though I think typing on my blue and brown switch keyboards are a bit more preferable for me. So if I was able to buy one of those mini keypads with these HyperX red switches, then I'd definitely consider buying one. Okay, so for now I think that'll be all regarding the HyperX Alloy Origin keyboard. I'd appreciate it if you subscribe, as I plan to release a lot more Osu content in the future, and follow my Twitter too, I do host Osu supported giveaways there. Other than that, thank you for watching, and I hope you have a great day.